Hey, vets, this is Ranger Johnson, master trainer with Champions for Veterans. That's championsforveterans.com. And if you need uh, help getting your VA benefits, go to our website. I'll give you more information at the end. Schedule time uh, for a visit, about a 30 minute Zoom visit, and uh, we'll help you with the benefits you need to get from the VA. All right. Hey, I'm going to teach a class today on probably something that a lot of uh, veterans hadn't heard of. It's called a KISSA grant, and I'll get into that in just a little bit. And I use this grant to uh, get a new walk-in shower, and you can do the same thing if you qualify also. And I'll talk about that in today's class. Let's go. All right. HISA, Home Improvement and Structural Alterations. It's a grant. Again, Home Improvement and Structural Alterations. I'll talk about how you can get this benefit if you qualify. Okay, let's talk about how to get started. This is actually how I got started. Visit your VA doctor. Now, I always recommend if you're a veteran and you have at least a 10% rating from the VA as service connected, start seeing your VA doctor. I know I hear about all the stories and this and that. I have the same VA doctor I've had for the last nine years. He's tremendous. I sit there. I can talk to this doctor, explain what's going on. I have a relationship with him. Over time, it's been built. And I recommend it to any vet that, that's in our program, get a VA doctor. Number two, explain your needs due to service connected or non-service connected issues with the HISA grant. This can be for service connected. There's a certain fee they give you, a rate they give you, which I'll talk about in the class, $6,800 maximum as of the recording of this class. And non-service connected issue, you can get up to $2,000, okay? Ask your VA doctor to put a note in your chart requesting a HISA grant. That's simply what I did. I mean, of course, my issue is uh, I'm 100%, but one of the main issues is degenerative disc L5 vertebrae, L5S1, tripping coming out of my shower. And I simply sit there and said, Doc, uh, and I told the truth, you know, coming out of my shower, I've tripped a couple of times. I caught myself, didn't go all the way to the ground, but, but I, I, I tripped. And, and of course, I've tripped and fell walking around my house on numerous occasions, but also come out the shower. The lip to my shower that I was talking about is about seven, seven and a half inches, almost eight inches high coming out of one of my showers. And it's become unsafe for me. And he simply put a note in my chart and he turned and said, you're gonna receive a packet and it's gonna have the information where you start moving through and getting this grant. And that's exactly what happened. He wrote that in the doctor's note. A few days later, the VA sent me a packet. Now, let me go over things that you can get from this grant, all right? Uh, modifications that, that cover on the HIS of benefits. And I took this information straight from the packet that the VA sent me, okay? Uh, these are things that you can get as an example. Some of, some of the things. Uh, roll in barrier free shower or uh, you can get a conversion a conversion from a bathtub to a, a shower seat they'll give that to you they'll widen doorways to support wheelchair access uh, entry and exit for your bathroom they'll go ahead and get that door wide to support that wheelchair coming in you can also have a access to a kitchen, a bathroom sink, a counter if you need that. Uh, entrance path and driveways, they'll, they'll help do that, help widen that. Hardwood floors, handrails, metal or wood, interior and exterior lighting. Could be more. This is just the things, again, I took from the packet that the VA sent me for the benefits for his. These are modifications not covered by kissing walk in sit down hydraulic jet pool spa things of that nature i'm glad i read this because i was going to request that next okay they cannot replace a bathtub with another bathtub can't do new home construction with this grant 
Another grant covers that, but not this one. If you get into adaptive housing grant, these are things that can be covered with new construction, things of that nature, but not the specific grant. Exterior decking, pathways that lead to a workshop and barns, routine repairs as part of regular home maintenance, like replacing a roof, a furnaces, or an air condition. We'll not do any of that. Elevator or home security. So those are some of the things that will not cover. All right, this is the policy uh, for service-connected veterans. Now, if you're service-connected, HISA grant, as of again, recording of this video, uh, will give you $6,800, $6,800. You know, when it's medical, medically necessary to help you. Bathrooms, I've already gone over the things that, that it will cover. All right, let me go over the ABC down here. A, this is uh, the eligibility. A veteran with a service connection disability requires home modification. B, a veteran rated at 50% or more service connected. And C, a veteran in receipt of 38 USC section 1151 benefits. Now, this was my first time seeing this. So I will tell you, I am not an expert at this 38 USC section 1151 benefits, but I research it and I'm going to give you a couple of things about it. If you're a vet that fits in this, I recommend you do more research, but here's a couple of things to tell you how you can qualify for the HISA if you fall in this category. A, status, uh, the status allows for veterans to receive compensation for a qualifications, additional conditions as if it were service connected in two circumstances. So these are the two circumstances that they talk about, okay? Carelessness, uh, neglect, lack of proper skill, error in judgment at a VA facility. Now, let's say you went to a VA facility and you had your back operated on. They messed it up, made it worse. Now under this 38, USC section 1151, this might be something you could ask for the HISA on that, okay? Or you see uh, E was proximately caused by the veteran's participation in a chapter 31 rehabilitation program or section 1718 uh, compensated work therapy program. If you're in this particular program and something happened to further affect even mess you up even more, this is something that you could possibly qualify for the HISA program with that. Again, please do your research. Not an expert at that at all, but I did want to let you know that's in the HISA package. All right, policies for non-service connected veterans. If you're not service connected, you can get up to $2,000. That won't do a whole lot uh, but you can get at least $2,000 for something if you're not service connected. That's why we always tell veterans in our program, uh, continue to fight for the benefits you deserve, okay? So you can get the full amount, which remember is 50% service connected. All right. Hey, here are the pictures you want to see. Before, this is my old shower. Let you take a look at that. Um, you see, you know, you had to step in that thing and then trying to step out of that in, in one of our bathrooms. And I did not get the, the uh, upgrade in my master shower because I already, had, I already have a shower in there. It is a seven foot step out. OK, so I put this in one of my other bathrooms in my home, which gave easier access. And in, in case I'm ever in a wheelchair, hopefully I'm not, but I could roll in there real easy and get in this shower. I also had them re uh, uh, put another toilet in uh, that's about two inches higher, a a and it's really really good. You'll see on the next picture. So that's the before picture. Now let's go to the after shot. All right, that's the after. Man, the contractors I brought in did a phenomenal job. So uh, let me kind of get into a little bit more details on that. 
when you receive your, your HISA package from the VA, uh, depending on the state you're in, they'll have a list of uh, contractors that they recommend. These are contractors that have already been vetted by the VA. And there's a list of about eight or nine in my package. I live in Louisiana. I went through those listed in there. I selected four contractors to call. I called four of them, set times up for these contractors to come to my home and visit and, and, and take a look at and tell me what they could do. Two of them, no call, no show on the dates they were supposed to be here. So, you know, that scratched them out automatically. Two of them came to my home. I ended up selecting one of those two to do the contract. Very happy with their work. On time, on target, communicated with me. They were phenomenal. No complaints whatsoever. And I worked with a lot of different contractors over the years. These were the best contractors I've ever had, period. They came in, did the work for the shower in four days. They started on a Monday and they were done by Thursday. And there were only two small parts that weren't done, but they, that was out of their control, trying to get the door handle, uh, something for that. And then a, a plastic that covered that when you open the door, and you'll see that in a minute, the doors are going to open. There's a piece of plastic uh, between the glass doors that keeps water from coming out. So, you know, they could not get that on order. They had to order that. So they came the next week and finished it out. So I'll just still say four days because that was out of their control. And it was phenomenal, all right? To cut the shower out, put this one in. And it's like a five-star shower, man. You find, I believe, in a, in a five-star hotel. Matter of fact, my contract informed me that this particular shower, had he did this in a civilian place that wasn't a VA, uh, he would have charged $10,000 for this, for the work he did at my house. Again, replace the toilet, that's a brand new toilet, two inches higher, handrail on the right-hand side. Look at the shower work, man. Look at the floor, the seat in there. Phenomenal work. They, I mean, they, they just did a phenomenal work. You would think this shower came with my home, but this was put in by these guys through the histogram. That's the picture of the door open, okay? You can see the place where you would sit, actually, uh, and take the shower. The handle comes down. It's, it's tremendous work. Uh, very, 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 my wife and I are very, very happy. I'm very happy with it. Tremendous work. And I want you to get yours if you qualify. That's why I'm teaching this class. Hey, this is what we do with Champions for Veterans. These are some of our success stories, right? I mean, we help vets get the benefits they deserve from the VA. Uh, upper right-hand corner, you see uh, Mr. John and Miss Pam. Mr. John was a Vietnam vet. Listen, he was rated 10% for 46 years after Vietnam. Yeah, 10% rating. Help them get to 100% in really about a 90-day period of time from 10 to 100%. Miss Pam and Mr. John, great people. Um, and, and I'm telling you, very deserving. Look, Derek, upper left hand corner, from zero to 100% in 11 months through the program. You know, full disclosure, that's my wife's cousin. Tried to help him for years. And finally, I said, man, let me help you. And we started working. He actually went from zero to 90% in 90 days and got to 100% in 11 months. And you got several other vets down there, man. Too many to talk about now, but this is what we do. A lot of success stories from people using our program. All right, how do we help you? Glad you asked. We have an online course called the Ranger Method, all right? And I teach it line by line, showing you how to get your VA benefits. We have coaching and a veteran community all right. And we have a winning statements template to show you how to write everything up, take you through the process. Now, if you're a veteran and you believe you need help, go to our website, www.championsforveterans.com. And when you go to our website, you'll put your information in there and schedule time for a Zoom visit. You'll meet with one of our veteran coaches. Come up. Take you through the process. If you want to move forward, 
great. Hey, I believe in it. Let me get a swig of water here. Because I got to get my energy up for the last thing I'm going to tell you. We hope you've enjoyed the program today. I'm excited. But I got to tell you what I tell all veterans. Stay in the fight!